Today's topic is Pompa disease, causes, symptoms, treatment, and more. Pompa disease is a rare genetic disorder that disrupts the body's ability to digest complex sugars. The lack of digestion results in glycogen buildup inside the muscles, affecting the muscles and other tissues in the body. The condition occurs due to a deficiency in the acid alpha-declosidase GAA enzyme, which is used in the digestion of complex sugars. The enzyme is affected due to mutations in the GAA gene, which are irreversible like most other genetic disorders. However, this inherited mutation is quite rare, with just 1 in 40,000 people in the U.S. suffering from this condition. Let's look at Pompa disease in detail and see how you can deal with it. Types There are three types of Pompa disease. 1. Classic infantile onset Pompa disease that occurs just a few months after birth. 2. Non-classic infantile onset Pompa disease that takes a bit longer, usually showing symptoms at one-year-old mark. And 3. Late onset Pompa disease, which occurs later in life. This type may show up deep into the teen years or at the start of adulthood. Symptoms Symptoms of Pompa disease vary according to the type you're dealing with. The symptoms caused by the classic type are 1. Enlarged muscles 2. Weak liver 3. Feeding problems 4. Breathing problems 5. Poor muscle tone 6. Interrupted growth 7. Inability to gain weight or muscle 8. Respiratory infections Non-classic Pompa disease symptoms include 1. Breathing problems 2. Deterioration in muscle strength 3. Delayed motor skills 4. Abnormal heart growth Late-onset type Pompa disease causes many of the same symptoms as the other two types, but can also result in 1. Weakened legs and trunk 2. Frequent lung infections 3. Problems with balance 4. Muscle pain in a large part of the body 5. Irregular heartbeat 6. Difficulty in walking 7. Fatigue 8. Hearing difficulties Do you know anyone with Pompa disease? How do they deal with the problem? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. Diagnosis After recognizing the symptoms, a doctor will conduct blood tests to check on enzyme levels. A low GAA level will indicate Pompa disease, and your doctor will aim to confirm the diagnosis by 1. Checking your family history 2. Conducting breathing and sleep tests 3. Checking on the heart with an ECG 4. Checking muscle function through electromyography. Treatment. Enzyme replacement therapy, ERT, is the only approved method of treating Pompa disease. A genetically engineered enzyme, called alglucosidase alpha, is injected into a patient's body intravenously to make up for the lack of GAA. Furthermore, you might also need some extra medical care if the symptoms become intense. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.